SkillPro is a European research project funded in the seventh framework program as part of the factories of the future. So the overall topic of SkillPro is the use of intelligent plug and produce components in the factory. An example for such an intelligent component for example, is an industrial robot equipped with a camera system and the gripper. So and instead of manually programming the directory to grasp the object, the robot is now intelligent enough to detect the object and then to automatically compute the collision-free directory to grasp the object and then place it at the desired position. But this realization of such an intelligent component is not the main focus of SkillBro. Our consortium consists of highly innovative partners which can already provide, to a certain extent, intelligent components as described before. More important question we investigate in SkillPro are how to describe the task, for example, how to describe which object is to be, has to be gripped and how to place it somewhere else. Then how to describe the abilities of an intelligent component, for example, that the robot is able to grasp an object. And then if you have a bunch of intelligent components, how do I find out that if I have a product that these intelligent com components can produce the product? And if this is solved, then it's the question now, if I want to produce with my intelligent components the product, um, how to establish a suitable communication infrastructure. In SkillPro, we're pursuing the idea of using existing industrial standards to solve the problems. For example, for the description of the task and the abilities and so on, we use Automation ML. And for the communication, we rely on UPC UA. SkillPro is now running since 18 months and they are still 18 months ahead of us. So we are in the midst of the project. And much to our delight, we can already show with our first prototype implementation at the midterm review, the targeted main concepts of SkillPro um, as stated before. So regarding the current status, I'm really looking forward to the second half of the project.